Hi everyone, what's up and welcome to this live stream. Today I want to talk or rather just edit my vlog with you guys. I've had this video sitting on my drafts for quite a long time and it's, I think it's time to just get it done. Uh, I've been having a lot of distractions. Today is the only time I have to edit it. If I don't edit it today, then it's going to be another uh, whole, probably an, another whole a week or two weeks before I get to edit it because there's a lot that is lined up for the coming week and I don't want my channel to be empty all right so I will try and edit uh, one video today I'm going to be using my editing software I normally use um, what do I use I use Filmora so I'll be sharing my screen shortly with you guys and if you're just joining make sure you hit the like button share me out connect with anyone who is on the chat if you have any question please just drop it on the chat and I'll be happy to give an answer to it and yeah that's basically how I'm planning to do this I don't have much uh, much other things that I, i'll be doing mostly i'll just be editing uh if you're able to follow through up to the end i will really appreciate it if not it's still okay so don't feel pressured you know don't feel pressured to get things to like follow the entire process this is just me pushing myself to get a video out there okay so basically uh, I'm just here um, sitting in silence. I'll put some background music and I hope that you will enjoy it. And also while we're here, I want to thank everyone who has joined StreamYard following my link. All right. Uh, there's a link in the description box. So if you want to know how to do live streams like these ones, you can definitely uh, reach me out on Instagram at Robertina underscore and I'll be happy to help you out um some some of you have already joined Streamyard. uh some of you also joined thematic which is also another platform that i use for copyright free music and that's just amazing so thank you everyone thank you for that i appreciate you all so very much yeah and if you want to see how we edited this video like uh the entire step by step on how we're going to edit this video please just log in uh, to your YouTube and get to see the step-by-step. -step. Watch this video. I'm going to share every single thing that I am going to be doing today with you guys live here. Yes, so thank you. And I will see you shortly.
Thank you everyone who has just joined. I want to acknowledge some of you who have already already joined. I can see OG Brand Brand. Thank you for always joining in and uh, supporting my live stream. Thank you to me best world. Thank you for coming. I'm about to start and as you can see on the screen there, I have uh, my Filmora software which is open. I want to start editing right now. Um, I have two videos that I wanted to share. Uh, this the the one you can see down there return shopping therapy there are more videos that have been doing uh the shopping therapy was two in one so i split the video because it was a bit long and uh i have the second cleaning videos part three part four christmas eve video gift shopping and all those things all right so those are some of the videos that i've been sharing uh rather editing using my uh, Filmora. So basically, if you have this software you, uh, installed on your laptop or your computer, what you need to do is to come to the new project here. Uh, once you open the new project, uh, it's going to open up. So we're just going to give it time for it to load. Uh, yeah. So let me see if, if it is still sharing the screen. I need to share the screen again. Did it disappear? So we're here. Sure. Okay, so yeah, I think uh, we're able to see that, right? So basically, what you normally, what you need to do is come to this part where I'm moving around my cursor. This is where you drop all the clips that you have been filming and you can just import them. There's a tab here, return import. Click on import, click on media file. And at this point, you should have your files or rather your videos already stored on your computer. Okay, so for me, I have a folder on my computer with has all my raw videos um i always on my desktop so i'm going to go to the desktop uh, right there i have raw draw to edit there i do so that once i open it i'm supposed to like pick from these folders i have videos from 15th december to 26th december which are yet to be edited but i won't edit those today because this is actually a, a travel vlog uh that we we, we you know we did we travel sometime in december but it's a lot of work and i need to get some extra clips because i want to do something different with it so i won't be editing that one today the video i want to edit however is actually here and it's a shopping haul for the month of january and these are the clips which are i have already uh put here so normally what i'm supposed to do here what you do is pick them all because it is easier if you just put them in one folder because you're able to select all of them like that then click open when you click on open they are going to add themselves onto the the media folder that you're going to be using and then from there you're going to be putting uh your video first video like for me this is my first video let me see. i think this is the one this one right here so as you can see, it looks like it is upright, so I need to make it slant. So I'm just going to right click on it. Actually, I'll, I'll add it for you to edit. Sorry for skipping all over the place. <laughs> for you to edit, you need now to bring these videos in order of how you want them to flow within your video to this area. All right. So these are these are the places where you're going to be adding your audios, your voiceovers, your text on videos your green screens everything and all that okay so but for me i try to keep it quite simple i have uh i'm going to pick on this video not pick on i'm going to pick this particular video just click on it like that and uh add it to the you're going to see it coming down here okay you're going to see it coming down here so once i pick it there it is so as you can see it is already down there and because i want it to be in landscape mode i'll just write on it uh, rotate it, rotate it again. I wish uh, the one thing that this Filmora doesn't have is the rotate option uh, to anti clockwise. You only have clockwise, so you have to go several times. Okay, so that's the video uh, that I wanted. It's now in good, uh, in good, uh, what do you call it? Uh, in good format. It's filling the screen, it's in landscape. 
and <clears throat> I'm able to now get it going. So I'm just going to start working on it. Uh, before I work on it, I also want to go and uh, do some video. I'm going to add some video tags to this live stream with you right now. I will, I will be showing you. So we're kind of like taking a short break because we're coming back to edit this. But yeah, I want to... These are all the videos that I want, I'm going to be adding on here. And you can drag your editing area, this area. You can drag it like that, if you can see. Just drag it so that your video can be uh, easy to manage. So from there, um, that's the first clip, okay? That's the first clip. I'll go on and on like that, adding uh, a video. This one, I, did, I don't need that one. I know I need this one, so I'll just click on add it. It's going there. Add the other one and so i'm just going to add all of them all right i'm just going to add all of them so that when i come back i also have to follow them normally for me i like to because also it depends with how did you film your videos and how have you ordered them there's a video you know this one comes before the other so just make sure you're following that uh process that uh order that you put there videos while you are editing so I'll just keep adding them like that, like that, and then once I'm done, I'll now come to the beginning, all right? I'll come to the beginning, I'll start editing, just playing, looking at what doesn't work, split it. I will show you all of that in a few. So right now, what I want to do is just to briefly, um, I want to briefly take you back to, where were we? I want to add tags on this video. I can see we have some new comments right there. Robertina, no problem. God knows how to change hearts. Thank you so much for the good compliments. Oh, you run, run. I appreciate you for that. I appreciate you and may God bless you so much for me. Okay. And so as we continue, let me put on some music for you so that um, I... I hope you'll be able to follow. I want to give you another tip on how I normally uh, optimize my videos. So I don't really mind that uh, we don't have many people here. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Robert, no problem. Okay, I need to find this chart. All right, yeah. So I need a good song for us to do that. To do that. Also, if you want to use these uh, songs, make sure that you let's go for this one. Check my description box. I'm going to have all the details there, and I'm going to put all the details right there. So, right now, let me take you to my YouTube Studio. I'll also take you through other different websites that I use to get tags to optimize my videos. So let's go into that. So I just want to make sure that while I'm doing the live stream, this live stream is actually optimized and it has all the right tags to it. So I want to show you how I normally do that. All right. So first of all, I can use either a website called Rapid Tags or I can use ChatGPT. We've already done a live stream here on how to use chat PPT. So I'm going to open the two websites and show you uh, both chat PPT. Show you how to get YouTube tags for your videos. All right. Okay, so let's go. Thank you everyone who's just joined. I can see two people in the live stream. Uh, when you come in, make sure you leave a like. As you go out, so I will really, really appreciate that. All right, so let me show you Village Boy 136. Sorry, Village Boy 136. How are you? Welcome, thank you for coming. We are editing a video just a uh, step by step. Right now, I want to optimize this particular live stream. So, I want to where should I go? Come here, okay. All right, so let me share the screen, my YouTube screen to stop sharing this one and uh, start sharing my YouTube video. Let me see you share screen. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so we are there. I don't know if you're able to see that. 
If you can see it with comments down below, then you can see it, I will continue. So I already did my my title, that's the title I want for this video, and then as you can see the description box is literally empty, it only has a title. Here, I know for a fact that I'll be using some songs in this live stream which have which I must credit the owners right here because of things to do with uh, copyright and those things. So I already have a list of the songs, so I'm just going to go back. Where do I go? Okay, one moment. Let me just pick those details from a different tab because I don't want to show so many <laughs> of my analytics online at the moment because I'm actually doing a uh, I'm waiting on, I'm waiting on, um, what am I waiting for? There's a video I'm waiting to do which concerns this analytics, so I'd rather not share them. So let me just pick them and then come with them. So I'm already in my YouTube studio in a different YouTube, um, I mean different tab. So there I will be able to pick, I don't think <laughs> Okay, it hasn't moved, right? It has not moved. So I think I'm okay with this. Uh, I want to pick my my previous live stream. I want to go there and pick the the description, the the songs that I use in that live stream because I'll be using just the same one. Copy. Okay, and then I will come to you. Excuse me. Alright, so I'm um, back here. As you can see, I'm going to just copy and paste. I'll paste the details that I wanted to share. These details are basically about thematic music and because there are many of you who normally ask me how to get, uh, where do I get my music, I use thematic or another platform called NCS. The song you're currently hearing in the background comes from NCS, okay? Alright, so I've already mentioned NCS right there. I need to put their links as well, but at the moment the most this one is the thematic and there I have explained in detail how you can get your your YouTube your your license link which you can use don't copy mine all right let me just tell you in advance don't copy the link that I have shared right here as you can see I have all these things uh, this is the list of the licenses so sure I don't get a copyright claim just explaining to you people how you are supposed to uh, use the music. So once you click on such a link, let's say it's for this song, it's say 10 pm in the maybe you like it and you find it, you find the link in my description. What you are supposed to do is to come and um, you're supposed to come and uh, well, and uh, go to that link, sign up on thematic. Once you sign up, you are able now to get your own different link. All right, so you should not copy this link. If you copy this exact link, you will get a copyright claim, and then you will come and tell me you use my link, and it got a copyright claim. But I'm already telling you not to use this link. All right, so you are not supposed to use this link. Just make sure that you go back to uh to your own uh, thematic, download that particular song or any other particular song that you like, and then the market will give you your own unique license i have explained it all in detail up there okay so i've explained everything in detail and you can see uh the first step is to get your own unique license to credit the owners of the music you downloaded from thematic you must include those links in your video description so that they are active and it protects your videos from copyright claims all right to get your unique license, you need to create your individual account on Thematic. I've put a link at the bottom of this description, so in case you just want to go to Thematic, you can go right ahead and register. There's a free version as well as a paid version. Well, the free version gives you five 
free song per month. And for you to get access to maybe a paid song, you need to review several songs. So that's my require some bit of work. If you don't want all that hassle, you can just go to the paid version, which is at $8 a month or $24, depending on your usage. I, for one, use the free version. Uh, I have not yet paid for the uh, pro version or upgraded version. Okay, so that's how I, I use my music from the market. And then another thing you have to ensure that uh, if you're just starting out, the market of course will give you a full month free access to all songs, but always ensure that you have all the right credit to those links. Okay, so that's what I wanted to share just quickly. And then the next thing as we are uploading our videos, what we have here is um, the area we're supposed to put uh, your thumbnail analyzer, not analyzer, like your thumbnail. I made this thumbnail earlier uh, on Canva. Uh, that's a whole different topic. I'm not going to pass on it right now. Okay. Yeah, so <coughs> the moment. Yeah, so Canva is actually a really nice platform. If you want to make quick graphics without any person, it works for me, it has been working for me for many years. I've made channels for some creators here on YouTube, and uh, very soon I will start monetizing that. So I tried to sell it, but I think I need some, I you know, some extra, uh, what do you call it? I will need some extra experience and portfolio boost to make sure that if I come to you and tell you this is the kind of work I've been doing with Canva, then you'll just be at me, oh, I'll cut it. So let's, um, let's try and do this, okay? So basically, uh, that's it. That's what I, I usually use. I use uh, Canva to make my first clip, my thumbnail. I make uh, also my YouTube banners and thank you for my super starters and village, not village. <laughs> Sorry, I'm seeing the village boy name on on the chat box. I guess that I just rolled out of my mouth. Yeah, so that's how I use Canva. So, so basically, uh, as I was telling you, the next thing here is now to go to um, go to the part where we need to put the tag, right? Okay, okay, so let's see. So right here, I don't know if you can see that this part tag. So normally, depending on your title, VDIQ and um, Two buddy have already shared some populated tags for you to use. Let's so see this one here with video editing. So I'll just click on it and it will just go to my star description. The other one is uh, how to edit YouTube videos. I think it is also relevant to this particular live stream. And then the other tab where there is how to edit videos. Okay. Alright, so that, those are the three tags that VDQ has provided for me on the three plans. Alright, very soon I pray that I will be able to get paid versions of all these softwares and that's what I'm working at. Okay, so another, I have three more tags which uh, now TubeBuddy has provided for me because I have the extension. Uh, we have how to make money on YouTube. I don't know if that is relevant to this video. I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, it sounds like something that someone might be interested to check. And also, I think we'll be talking about it because I always like to talk about how to make money. So I think it might be relevant. And then there's the YouTube monetization. I think this tag came about because of the fact that on the title, I've written how to monetize a YouTube video. Because after we are done editing the video that we had started editing earlier, we are going to put the monetization, put in the new growth, so you all how to do all of that, okay? And then uh, another, the last free tag that I've been given, normally I like to use just all of them. <laughs> Let me be honest with you. How to make money on YouTube, I don't know. How to make money on YouTube, make money on YouTube, they look almost the same, but doesn't have to have all of them there, all right? So as you can see here, let me change the layout so that we're able to see the entire, entire thing. Let me click on here. I don't know if it's going to work. Perfect. This is 
perfect. At least you're able to see the full screen. Okay. So now, um, <coughs> where was I? Let me go back to my video. Okay, so here, uh, as you can see, this part, let me try and zoom this page. Alright, now you're able to see it clearly. So if you look here where I'm pushing my cursor left to right, I've only used 143 characters, yet I've been provided with 500. And also, uh, another important thing to, to note is that YouTube, they tell you that tags can be useful if content in your stream is commonly misspelled. Otherwise, tags play a minimal role in helping viewers find your stream. That being said, it doesn't mean that you should not make use of the feature that allows you to use tags, okay? When, uh, the moment you choose to use these tags for your videos, you're able to optimize your video. If someone is looking for how to edit YouTube videos and they type it just exactly like that, and they're probably looking for creators who are in Kenya or in that particular area that you're in, your video is likely to pop up on the search results because you have that tag on. So anything that you can do to help out your channel, do it. I normally like to make sure that I fill out my tag area with as many tags as possible to ensure that at least in future, this thing will probably happen for me. Like there's a video I was telling you if you have been following my community post, there's a video that uh, actually got um, it just it was sitting at 200 views then out of nowhere it started just shooting up and that video when you check the VDIQ score it has a hundred percent and I believe that is the reason why it started shooting up and when I look at the reasons why it is going viral it's because uh, of the search terms they are consistent with what I have on the what on the tag so that is really really amazing for me okay so i want to quickly move to something else uh we have um we have how many tags several tags we have just a few tags and we need to add them to fill out this number 500 okay so let me go to rapid tag so rapid tag i need to share the tab uh rapid tag all right so first of all let me just quickly uh, change just a minute give me one minute Okay, so first of all, you go to your search engine. If you're on uh, Apple products, you can go to Safari, uh, or Google, or whatever. So on Google, look for Rapid Tag, right? So we are there. Rapid Tag, the first website, this one with an R logo, that's the one you're going for. Uh, once you, lo you, you open it, this is what happens. It's right there, rapidtag.io. And uh, there are several ways that you can use it. You can use the paid version, but normally for me, you don't know. I, I prefer to save money. And as you can see right here, it tells you, start growing quicker than ever on YouTube. You're all in one website solution for YouTube video SEO and channel automation. Of course, uh, this is more like a salesy uh, type of uh, phrase like start growing quicker than ever on YouTube. That one you cannot definitely believe it 100%, but it will help you at some point. It will not happen overnight, but it doesn't hurt to to try. So when you click on use the tag generator, it tells you. Of course, it's a website that. Uh, uh, leaves off on adverts that's why there's this advert here you can click to close it so seeing this ad uh, ad cover content then just give a reason there 
right so it asks you to enter your youtube video title to the lower tab so let's go back to our video title i'm just going to copy paste and bring it here for you guys no need to go all the way back with me you can already see the video title all right so then please i'm just going to copy then come here and paste it right here all right so I'll, after pasting it uh, i can choose to remove the edit with me can remove that one and then leave this part because i need tags that are consistent with this particular title then click on search so the moment you click on search you can see all the tags that have come through all right so these tags they look very actually in my eyes these are amazing i'm actually going to use them but before we do that i also want to show you how you can use chat gpt for the same function so we are going to come to chat gpt with another google tab i'm going to type in chat gpt yeah. um right <coughs> so good morning yeah okay i don't think it's loading i think it's loading yeah. chat gpt Let's try the card here. Yeah, we need to get a card to put on. How can I help you today? All right, so here, as we've done this before, but if you're new, normally just make sure you have signed up for an account with ChatGPT. Use the the software to help you with getting these technical things. Don't make it work for you, because sometimes it may give you very generic answers to things, and uh, you end up like giving results which look the same as your colleagues or your your fellow friends or students or whichever so normally what i like for it to do i like for it to just do the technical stuff like i'll do the same thing that well that we've done with rapid tag i'll go there paste my title and just before the title starts i'll type please generate or rather i don't even if you please but i'll use it anyway so it's um humble please you know rates youtube it's four tags for this type and you'll see what it comes up we'll compare it with what we have with rapid tags all right so i think that's an a good enough prompt and we click enter so I can, as you can see i think it also has some really decent tags. It has generated 15. Uh, there's YouTube reve revenue generation, content creator tips and tricks, so more editing techniques, edit with me tutorial, YouTube SEO tips, and all those things. All right. So this list, compare it to this list. I think this one, how to upload football videos. I can, I can definitely get rid of that one how to upload with two football videos this might work for one of my youtuber friends called janet global please check out her channel uh yeah this one i'll show it her hopefully it will happen so i can remove that and i'll be left with this so i'll copy this tag then i'll come to my video all right we are going to go back uh to the we're going to go back to the tags area remember we already have six tags there so i think i'll remove this one the make money because it looks like it's repeating itself then i will paint what i've gotten from rapid tag all right so i've just done my paste there and if you can see we have exceeded the 500 limit so i need to <laughs> i need to delete some of them so like i can remove the one about football and the thing so far so good so we are at 459 tag i don't think there's any other because it is mentioning filmora and all those things that i am using today so it is very very much relevant so i'm going to click on save all right so another thing i might say is uh there, there are these numbers these are just uh where the video runs on if you search results like if you search wonder share filmora editing this video might come at number 23 in search 
or uh, number three, if you search for Mora, like uh, if you search for Mora, it, it there's a chance. It's not guaranteed that there's that chance, all right? Yeah, so I think uh, in case you feel like you need more tags with good IQ extension on your YouTube channel, you can click here to refresh tags. As you click on refresh tags, you can give you fresh new tags. As you can see, I've gotten three extra fresh tags. Like we have video editing for beginners. We also have video editing apps. All right. And then we have another video editing tutorial, which is exactly what you're doing. And that's why I actually love uh, VDQ. Now, I need to remove the, some of the tags so that I can stay within my 500 character limit. I'm going to remove this one that says how to find and download movie clip. We are not doing any of that today, so I'm just going to delete that one. Yeah, and I think my tags are done. And how long did that take? About 20 minutes. 20 minutes but if you're into it i guess it's also because i was explaining every step uh, of the way without copyright okay yeah so that uh, i think that is done that is done the tags are there and i think i'm good so another thing you can actually do while you're there on the tags you can come here copy them you know once you copy them you're going to bring them to your description your description has your description has 5000 characters for you to use okay and i think i have that space. so i can just come here at the very very bottom enter a new line all right so i just want to separate them and then put it there the reason i'm doing this is because it's going the more uh, keywords you have the better for your video because you, you are able to to boost the video much better all right so they start and then uh, that one what I can say is that we are basically more like learning I just want to go and separate after the comma I want to put a space so that it is readable Right. If any one of you wants to use these tags, you can just go to my description, copy and paste them, and use them on your video. And I've done the work for you. Quite easy. Quite easy. And then uh, I'm just removing the space after the comma. I would have had. Actually, I should have done this with ChatGPT. Let me show you another trick with ChatGPT. You can just come here and uh, ask. You to take to add a space after every comma, so I'll just write add a space <laughs> after every call instead of me going all the way doing it one by one. And this will be done in seconds. So I paste everything there, enter it, and look for the result. All right? So there it is, it has already done it. Okay. I forgot to share it sorry i forgot to share that part so let me do it again you come here we are now on chat ppt click on add a space after every comma so the reason why we're doing this is because when i copied my tags each tag is separated by a comma from the next one and i needed I need them to look a bit more presentable, so I need some space after the comma. So that's what I'm asking ChatGPT to do for me. Instead of me doing it one by one, it's gonna take forever. So and then when I enter like that, you can see the result is right there. It has separated everything uh, well. So I need to give <laughs> ChatGPT a thumbs up because I've made it do the work twice, but it is the same thing. All right, so I'm just going to copy them again. I know this looks like a lot of work for some of you, but I think once you are used to it, it becomes super easy. So I'll just come and delete all these uh, crowded tags with that here. Just delete them, then paste the new ones, which are looking more presentable. Oops, and I hope I don't delete everything. Alright. <coughs> uh, this is a Sunday. Uh, if you're just joining, make sure you like the video. Make sure you leave a thumbs up on your way out. 
uh, like the video, tell me out if you can, and I will really appreciate you. Alright, so I think we are done on everything to do with optimizing this video. As you can see on this side, uh, you can see we have 48 out of 50, and I think that's a pretty good score to begin with. So we're going to save that. We already did the monetization, so now we're going to go back to uh, editing our video. All right, Helen Akoya, thank you for coming. Hello, I'm on but busy on background. No problem, Helen Akoya. I appreciate your presence here. Yeah, thank you so much. I know it's a busy Sunday. It's also the day I'm also free. I don't have any other time from Monday to next Sunday. I will be extremely busy. If I make it on YouTube, by God's grace, so I had to come. I have to edit my video today. Find a day when it will premiere. I'll probably not also be available when it is premiering. But uh, yeah, so I want to start trying this thing, all right? Start trying and then now look for the video. We are already started the editing process. We have imported all the videos, but all the clips that we're going to be you know to be editing and while we do that i want to take a short break it's been 45 minutes since we began then i'll be back and then we can finally edit that video okay all right
Hi everyone, thank you. I'm back. I can see Helena Koya in the background. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for your presence here. Laura, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining. I see Ifeni Cool. Thank you for joining and supporting me all the way from Germany. I appreciate you so very much. So I want to resume uh, my process on um, <clears throat> editing my video. Normally I use Filmora editing software and that's what I want to share on the screen. I have this video that has just been sitting in my drafts for quite a while and I need to edit it because if I don't I have a very busy week ahead and I might end up not editing it at all until another maybe two weeks and I don't want that to happen. I want uh, to leave my channel active with something to follow, something to watch, all right? So we had already begun the process of editing this video, as you can see on the screen right there. Uh, it's just loading. Uh, we have basically the first thing once we open Filmora, uh, first of all, you need to have a Filmora uh, software editor on your installed on your computer, that is your laptop or your desktop, whichever one that works with you or your um, tablet, I guess, or iPad. And then after that, uh, you input all the short clips that you have been editing. I mean, not editing, filming for that particular vlog. Let's say you are doing a cleaning vlog or um, work vlog, cooking vlog. Uh, you just filmed yourself explaining something let's say you are doing a presentation whichever it is any type of video you can edit using Filmora all right so now I, I am ready to get started and I want to just quickly open the file I had started earlier because I had saved it let me finally open the recent one the, because this video is going to be the January shopping haul all right uh, I'm going to be editing this video in the background because sometimes I've been moved. Wait, what's happening here? Locate. Okay, I don't know what's up. I don't know what just happened anyway. And what? Wait, 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 wait. Did I lose my clips? Okay, and it seems I don't have some of these clips here. Where are they? Where did they go? I need to find them. So I can see which ones are not there. All right, allow me to allow me guys to work in the background. Thank you everyone who is coming. I'll just be looking for these clips, which apparently are no longer here. As you can see, let me just try and zoom this. <coughs> no, I'm not able to zoom it. But as you can see, it tells me that there's a right here. There's a, this clip, this clip, like four clips. Yeah, they are four. One, two, three, four. The red one. They are not here. So I need to find them. Make sure they are here. Because I can't edit without them. Otherwise, there will be no point of editing this entire video. Alright, so let me find them. In the background, keep watching. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you, Laura. Thank you, Ifani Cool. Thank you, Helen. And everyone who is here. Mm -hmm. Let me put on some music. And... If you are able to do some other work uh, while we're here, I will really appreciate that. I, yeah, I will really appreciate if you're able to do some other work so that I can be editing in the background because I also need to concentrate and do work. I'll be checking in on you. I'll be checking in on everyone to see how, how you're all doing. All right. Okay. So there's a volume.
one trick on my sleeve I can show you But I can guarantee you look at me and see That I'm the type of girl you're not really that used to I'm only gonna give it to you honestly I know this right taking some time But I know I'll be okay show you but i can guarantee you look at me and see that i'm the type of girl you're not really that used to i'm only gonna give it to you honestly i know this right taking some time but i know i'll be okay
Trick on my sleeve, I can show you, but I can guarantee you look at me and see that I'm the type of girl you're not really that used to. I'm only gonna give it to you honestly. I know this right, taking some time, but I know I'll be okay. Coffee black now, sugar coat and everything don't make it sweet. And all the time I've given up, I'm taking back now. I've been spending all my hours differently. Cause it's never too late to live what you say. And I know I'll be okay. Trick on my sleeve, I can show you, but I can guarantee you look at me and see that I'm the type of girl you're not really that used to. I'm only gonna give it to you honestly. I know this right, take it.
Hello, hi everyone. Hi Goga. Hi Sharon. Thank you guys, Mr. Ifeni Cool. Thank you so much for showing up. I see Miss Mungai React. Thank you guys for coming. I really had to do that. I had to edit my video and I thought why not share it with you. Of course, I'll dedicate another live stream showing um step by step. This is my January shopping haul. As you can already tell, we are in February at the moment and if I don't if I do not post that video it's gonna take forever because I have a very busy next coming week and I won't be able to keep up with editing posting and all those things all right so thank you so much for sticking around here I appreciate you all very much I appreciate your support your time here is highly valued it's been two hours and i think i've achieved something that i wanted to do right so until next time i want to wish you well i also have helena Cora in the background she was here earlier or maybe she already left and um we also had lydia Kiketi. thank you so much girl for coming we had laura um we also had village boy yeah so thank you everyone who came through for this uh live stream it's already two hours i need to go do some other things it's a sunday i have a fully packed coming week and i appreciate every one of you who made it today so thank you so much and i hope to see you next time for now it's goodbye from me and i hope that you're going to know if you have any question actually uh if you have any question make sure that you chat me down my plan was to finish exporting that video uh, but i realized that is gonna take maybe another one hour and i need to be doing other things then upload the video to youtube with you do the entire process with all of you yeah but uh, you'll just have to forgive me for now but the vlog is coming soon if you see it make sure you watch it all right thank you so much i appreciate you god bless you see you in the next one and for me it's goodbye oh uh, first of all i need to redirect uh, five of you so let me see where i'll send you to thank you so much if any cool bye bye for now until next time be safe be happy keep spreading positive vibes I always enjoy your live streams they are very very entertaining and educative and inspiring especially your art in drawing that's just amazing so uh i appreciate you for being here let me put you guys uh on music as i find a channel which we are going to redirect to actually i just send you there i won't need uh you know to, like, just go there stick around if you are able to uh mention that you're coming from this live stream i will really appreciate if not that is still highly welcome all right so for now it's goodbye for me now we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Follow the light if you're not sure. Listen to your girl. To your girl. The right path might come when the time is right. Go for you. Take your own method. Back for the one who's trying to be perfect. Yeah. Go try to match it. Don't be sad if you don't make it up. You hope for one lives, live and life means making blunders. It can make you shatter. You will try to fight the thunder. Trust me, no matter what happens, because I will stay by your side in your heart. Whatever happens, remember that you can do anything you want. Da -da 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 -da
the dust I was born to the dirt I shine 